What is up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. As today, we are doing a tier list on Nintendo IPs. So, yeah. Let's just hop right into it. So, first off, we have Animal Crossing going in D. I'm sorry. Again, my personal opinions. I know I'm just going to get freaking butt raped in the comments. I really don't like Animal Crossing. I think it is very, very boring. Duck Hunt, since he's only had one game, deserves to go an A, but he is still one of the classic video game characters of all time. DK hasn't had just one game, but DK is another one of the classic characters of all time. He introduced us to Mario. He captured Pauline. He had his own series of the Donkey Kong Country games, which are fantastic. Earthbound, I haven't played it, but I really don't like Ness or Lucas and Smash Brothers, so I'm basing it off of that. Fire Emblem, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like Fire Emblem. I can't do that tactical RPG type thing coming from the guy who literally plays, who played Mario and Rabbids Kingdom Battle. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't, I just don't know why I don't like it. I tried. F Zero with the man with the golden nipples. I'm bet yeah, that's gonna go in B because he hasn't had a new game in a while, and all they are is just racing games. So that's it. Uh, I have no idea what. The oh, that's Kid Icarus. I never played them, so I can't put a judgment on it. Kirby. Kirby is that little pink puffball that everybody loves, and if you get in his way, he will fart on you. Easy and simple as that. Kirby is the best. Now, this is going to make everybody mad. I don't like Metroid. I believe me. I played a bunch of the games and I have given it I've given it a fair chance. I just don't like them. I don't know why. I've tried. The only Metroid I like is the Metroid game nobody else likes, Metroid Other M. Like what the heck? I literally spent an hour and 45 minutes on Metroid Samus Returns when it first came out. And I couldn't take it. It was boring. Pokemon, it was my childhood, and I haven't really played the game, so... B. Pikmin, mm, it's a unique idea, so I'm going to put in A. It's a unique... now. I'm going to put it in B. It's a unique idea, for sure. I love the mechanic. The day and night transition. So, yeah. Little Mac with Mr. Mac himself. He's going in A, because I've only played the NES version, and I like Little Mac and Smash Brothers. Speaking of Smash Brothers, Smash Brothers is going in S for Super Smash Brothers. I'll go home. Star Fox. <laughs> so, nah, I'm putting in C. I did not like Star Fox Zero at all. I thought it was very boring, as a lot of people did. And I haven't played... I've only played... The first stage of Star Fox 1 just to unlock Star Fox 2. And I haven't even played Star Fox 2. So yeah, that's a problem. Splatoon is going in S because, oh my god, what, did I, what a fun third person shooter that is. It is a lot of fun. And I, ha and I don't think I've ever had as much fun with a third person shooter that was kid friendly. Like, I've played a lot of shooters in my day. Call of Duty, Uncharted. But you're spraying ink everywhere. How awesome is that? I love the Splatoon. Wario, haven't played it, but I think Wario's a fun character. Xenoblade. I've only played Xenoblade 2, and I highly enjoyed that game. So it's going in um, A. Yoshi. I like Yoshi. I love Woolly World. Crafted's World. Eh. It was alright, I guess. And then, obviously, the last two are going in S tier, because Zelda and Mario, obviously. I don't need to say anything about that. So, yeah, that's it, guys. So, uh, yeah, a very, very short video. Let me see. Yeah, very short video today. <laughs> very short video. But uh, that's it. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more tier lists. Hope you all enjoyed the video, and uh, yeah, that is it. Peace out, guys.